Happy Labor Day from the shop, guys. Before I forget, the background music today is Suitcase Junket. Suitcase Junket. One man band. Got some slide guitar, all kinds of kick drums, and who knows what. I'm going to give you a link below. So, hey, you found me gluing up a neck, a fingerboard on a neck of another coffee can guitar. They seem to be pretty popular lately. You might be asking yourself why I haven't been releasing that many videos lately. Well, there's something going on in the background. I don't know if you know this or not, but I sit on the school board. Wow. I'm going to give you a link below to that side of my life. Uh, it's just as crazy as this, in fact, worse. And um, if you happen to be in the Acton Aguadose, California area, yeah. All right, so subliminal messaging completed. Let's uh, put this off to the side and get back to why we're here. This. Now, you know that at some point, this turns into this. Pretty tricky, huh? Now, you've seen this one before in an episode called Coffee Can Guitar. Uh, what I'm going to focus on today, and that's all what we're going to talk about today is in that episode. There's a link for that right up here, showing up on an iCard right about now. Um, housekeeping, yeah. While we're here, uh, at the end of the video is my email. Send me an email with your comments, questions. The subscribe button is in the middle, and then there's playlists where you just click on and it runs through my whole list when you're really bored and you've got nothing else to do. Anyway, back to this guitar. We've seen this before in the coffee can guitar episode, but I want to focus in today on this pick pickup, specifically this pickup right here. Okay, so we're going to get this off and we glued up the fingerboard onto the neck. And again, this is a cigar box or not a cigar box but a coffee can guitar and uh, we're gonna end up with a butternut can underneath it All right. I like to hang my stuff up as I'm going and, and doing the tear down because if you don't your whole shop is a mess which mine usually is anyway all right there we go got some work to do to flatten this out on the side but again I made this neck it all turned out pretty well but this is the area right here we're going to focus on now believe it or not but this pickup this coil actually costs less than ten dollars it comes with this uh, wood piece and this wood piece right here as on my other coffee can guitars is going to sit here and you'll notice that the wood piece that covers the coil is just a tad below the fingerboard the frets will also be up just a little bit more once they're on so this sits down where the strings aren't going to hit it now it's cut out or routed out it's got a little indent for this to drop right in so what I've done on the neck here is made a little slot where that sits down in there the coil part sits down in there like so now you know that i use a lot of these and i always end up with this part left over so what i do on these coffee can guitars is i cut a slot out that's just enough for that to sit there like that now you know i'm going to add another piece from here to about here to strengthen it and glue that on but this will be underneath or in between this piece of wood and the piece of wood like so here which allows it to move around uh, and have a little bit of play and flex when it gets hot and cold anyway that will sit like that and then this goes over the top like so and once I level it up I drill down through get my bolts through here to hold this and clamp this down and then decide whether or not I want to cut these ends off or not. All right, let's have a look at the completed setup on a guitar I think you're familiar with. Um, there we've got uh, the cover. We've got the coil there. It's set down inside the neck uh, and there is the 
bottom of the floating bridge part right here and you can see that this is adjustable and I've used nylon insert wash or knots here so nothing comes undone. I've shrink wrapped this wire to make it a little bit more durable to run in the can and I've used this little piece of cut out metal to hold the wiring in place and yeah there it was it's a coffee can guitar that won the first place ribbon at the Antelope Valley Fair cultural capital of the world now I, I think that this would work equally well you see this guitar this has a Delta groove pickup here by uh, Darren Dukes um, love these things but um, if I were to take this here you notice it slides in under just it's right even or a tad under the fingerboard so if I were to want to use this setup on a guitar all I would have to do was is put that part like so trace it out inset it just a little bit into the top of the box uh, and do the same with this and this less than ten dollar pickup would work great on just about any guitar that you want to coil on um, I'm going to give them a, a shout out these come from MGB guitars uh, guitar parts they also had uh, products represented in the tuners and the mail order neck episode so I finally fessed up MGB guitars Michael Breedlove love your product never had a problem uh, getting the stuff here quickly or what I needed and so is great quality so put that in your bag of tricks there builders less than 10 bucks to the door all right so back to work on this thing I got to have this done for the raffle for the fair in less than two weeks uh, and then it will be back on the campaign trail remember ABC always be campaigning all right, there it is, our cheap pickup installed and uh It sounds really good for the money, it really does. Um, I think there's multiple uses for this and if you're trying to keep your builds economical uh, for people, this is a good way to go. You know, I don't um, endorse many products, but yeah this is one you want to have in your arsenal all right now i'm going to end this by telling you as part of my campaign for school board uh, i am going to be in the agua dulce county fair parade in what my wife is describing as a spectacle anyway i'm going to be playing some guitars that i've made and making just some general noise and uh, creating a rock as so people remember that and then this guitar is actually going to be in the raffle so I don't care where you are Florida uh, New Zealand England London Manchester go man you you need to get on a plane and get out here on September 15th because you could actually win this in the Aguadose County Fair raffle <laughs> See you next time.